Rebecca Crosby and today I'm making a video on how to make a magnet that has not been a magnet but it attracts to the magnet attracts to other stuff with iron steel and stuff like that in it so we're making stuff that is not a magnet that will that will not attract like this to it because it doesn't have that power to it. So me and my dad are going to work on this today. I also have a paper hair clip that has been in my hair for some reason um, to test out. And you need a battery for this. And if you want to use your fingers, you can, or you can get some tape. Because if you do, you know how your mom and dad always tell you don't leave the door open because the air will go through. It's basically like that, but we can't see it just like the air. It will go through it like you electricity will go through the door. If you leave the tape open or your finger off of the wire, then it will not work. Because and it's not touching the terminal, right? So what yeah. are we doing? So what are we doing? We are um, wrapping the wire around and I see this little end. It will go to it. Let me see up close. This is what you use. Oh, yeah, what kind of it? Dad's wrapping the wire around the This is plastic barbed nail. wire. It's not barbed it's, wire. It's plastic, it's plastic coated wire. Plastic coated wire. That's I mean. copper wire on the inside. That's copper wire on the inside. So what we're going to be doing today, like I said, we are making a magnet. Well, those of you who are cooking dinner grind, this will be a little video that will show you what you will be doing in mm -hmm. higher grades. Take this piece of tape okay. and put this copper piece right here on the end. Hold on. We gotta lay that and tape that wire to it. Like that? Mm-hmm. Okay, oh, it came out. <laughs> I'm not very good on this because I have never tried this before. This is my first time in my life doing this. So me and my dad are working on this so I do not blow up my house. This is an experiment. Yeah. Here, hold the nail. And on the experiment, we always, always have to, um... You always do things like this with an adult. Yeah. But here's the thing I don't get. How do they keep it from going off, off and stuff when they're just holding it? And then they hold the map, hold it too. Well, this is going to be an electromagnet, right? Yeah, an electromagnet. See if it can pick that up. It does because it's made of iron steel. Okay. What now, kind of hair clip is that? That is a um, a metal hair clip. Yeah. A little brat. Okay, and there's a fork. Yeah. Now, if you take hold the fork on there, if you take the wire off of the battery, what do you think is going to happen? It's going to let go. See? Yeah. Once you take the wire off or your finger off, it will In junkyards, that's again. how they pick up cars see. and stuff. Yeah. Alright, put the nail to the floor. Alright, let your sister see. It doesn't pick it up, does it? No, because it doesn't have electricity staying in it, so it will go through the wire and go onto the, go onto our nail. So and it attract will go, the metal. And attract the metal. So we need to do what? Keep the tape on. Okay, so we put the wire on there. Look what will happen if it gets close to it. It just attracts like north and south poles go together and south and north poles go together. But you know how they repel from each other? Well, that's the... I like poles repel each other. That's how... That's where it gets weird. But this kind of magnet always sticks. Unless you um, take the tape off. Yeah, that's a pretty good strong magnet, isn't it? Yeah. What size battery are we using? This is a double A battery. Okay. And this is something that you can do at home with your parents. And it's uh, just an energizer rechargeable? Oh, yeah. And does I it matter what kind of battery it is? Nope, nope. doesn't matter. The stronger the battery, the better the magnet. How does the electricity get into the battery? The electricity is put into the battery. You either buy it at the store already Dad, charged if it's, it's a regular nothing. battery. Or if it's a 
rechargeable battery, then you have a charger pack that you put the battery in and plug it into the wall and it recharges the battery. Also, you. if you keep the tape on while you're not even picking up the stuff, then it will get really hot like it is right now on my hand. Yeah, it so I'm, warm. So, so I'm just going... Because electricity is flowing through the nail, huh? Yeah. And that and heats the, it up. But here's the weird part. You know how North, South, and South Poles repel each other, and North and mm -hmm. North Poles repel each other? Because they're alike. If they're alike, they will not go together. If they're opposite, they will go together. But mm -hmm. this magnet never does that. That's what they no, say. Opposite the track. It will do that. It's just the, the poles are in different places. Yeah. Uh, it's not labeled. Huh? But you can see it works. Yeah. Yep. It works. And now, that, what kinds of things do they use magnets in? They use magnets. Do it again. I'm going to show up close. Awesome. Dead? Okay. Okay, now let's do my paper clip. Hair clip. Hair clip, yeah. Move your hand out of the way. Alright, hold it up and I'll drop it. Three, two, one. See? Now that doesn't work. And that's work. how an electromagnet works. And now it doesn't work because... Can we... I see where you taped it onto the battery? Mm -hmm. See, we've got the... On the negative side, the flat side of the battery, we've got it mm -hmm. taped on. And I'm just putting the other cord, the other copper the other wire. piece of the wire. And it's got to be copper wire uh, or else it might not work as strongly. But because copper is can... a good conductor of electricity. That's right. You can touch it to the positive terminal and it will actually... It will work. So you can see I am not doing this outside because it just rained. If it didn't rain, I would be doing this outside. But if it were were if I were doing this outside, then we would have a big table and a couple chairs. But since it just rained outside and my puppies are really well, this is an experiment we could do inside. Well, also you need to remember, kids, if you do this. Uh, you need to have adult supervision to do this. You don't need to just play with electricity. And, and don't, batteries have chemicals you know, in them. Batteries have chemicals in them. And don't do this with a plug in the wall. That can be very, very dangerous. It can hurt you very badly. Yeah, like he, your hands are wet. Benjamin Franklin got shocked and he almost mm -hmm. died. Now, what kinds of things do they use magnets in? They use magnets in science, mm -hmm. labs. Mm -hmm. And they also use it for little videos to show little kids that are learning about. Yeah. Do you know any kind of machine or, or devices they use? I've been in a giant magnet before when I had to have a test done at the hospital. Yeah, they also use it for people who... It's called an MRI. They also use stuff to help yeah. other people so it's they like can get better. Mm -hmm. Kind of like an x-ray, yeah. So Did you know computers use magnets? Yeah, that's why you can't put magnets on computers. Going through them like right. a battery, except it's a low. Our wire. phone or our camera also uses magnets as well. Yeah, and that's what we're right. shooting with. Mm -hmm. So we. And if it weren't for the rechargeable battery in here, I wouldn't be able to shoot the video. That's right. Yeah, so that's why I'm making this little video. I said, like I said before, I would. I told my teacher I would do this, and why do you know I am? Because I was telling the truth. Now, Dad. One more time before we go? Yeah. All right, I'll hold it on there. You go ahead. What about kids? Can, can I use the metal part? part of my glasses? No. No, uh, let's not do are, your glasses. Those are brass. Plastic. Those aren't. Look. Those screws are brass. Good job, right. guys. All right. Shall we say goodbye? Bye-bye. Have a great day. Good job.